And Alexis King has this scoop, and she's been talking about it all morning. Very, very fun form of theater. Yes, exactly. There's many forms of theater, and today we are mastering the art of puppetry, although mastering might be a stretch, <laughs> at least for me. But I'm going to try to pull some strings here, go. so to speak. So let's move on over. Janet, if you haven't met them yet, this is Lion Hill and John Scullin from the Columbia Marionette Theater. Mm -hmm. And so I'd like to welcome you once again here uh, in our studio this morning. We've had fun with you this morning, and now the fun ends, because I'm going to try my hand at this, and I'm not going to I'm oh, not gonna look fun, a little nervous. The fun begins for us. Okay, exactly. <laughs> okay. So how long did it take you guys to look? Well, I know you've okay. been doing it since you were a kid. I've been so doing second it since nature I was for a you. Kid, yes. How about you? Uh, you know, it, I think it's different for every person. We, we're going to show you the basic moves okay. in just a few seconds. And okay. then from there, it's your imagination that's going to take it and, and bring this puppet to life. Like how much practice would one typically get? Well, uh, before anyone gets a main character on one of our stages, they're probably going to be working with us for several months. Before okay, they operate a main okay so forgiveness, y'all, for me. All right, here we All go. All right, now I'll show you just the basics of it here on the control bar. The head strings are right here close to the middle, so the whole thing is balanced right here. You can see it. You okay. can put one little balance spot. Okay. So you hold on to it right there. Hold on to it right here. And all you have to wow, do to make it to walk is rock the control bar back and forth as you move it forward, and that's going to pick it up and walk. You see there's not much movement that's needed, just a little bit. Could I try to walk her backward? Yeah. <laughs> doesn't she work walks. as well, but you can turn it, okay, the control bar it. around. Okay. Feeling it out. There you go. And this is yeah. Flora. My, my little puppet, and let me ask you this, um, what, what would I call my a puppet handler? You are a puppeteer. Puppeteer, puppeteer okay. yes, even so if it's a marionette, which is just a type of a puppet. Now, with your other hand, you could reach around and grab this one continuous string that's right here. So that is connected. And that I is connected that. to both hands like that, so you can just pull the one string and have both hands Oh, okay. Move. That I didn't know. I thought you had to be kind of ambidextrous or something. Okay, I see. <laughs> I see. Let's see there if I go. can walk and chew gum at the same time. And the answer is no. <laughs> Why is it? Okay. I just fell off a bicycle, so I don't <laughs> walk so good. Yeah, I would suggest, you know, uh, try. Oh, there we go. There you go. Yeah, you can, you there can you walk go. and oh move gosh, your hand. Oh, my gosh, it's like Forrest Gump. Now, the, the, fi the final move, now, you notice our marionettes all have um, fixed expressions. Okay. It's in rare cases, we have moving mouths, like on dinosaurs and things. But to get uh, facial expression, you want to take uh, one of your fingers that's under here okay. and use it to pinch the two little strings you'll find I directly the under the strings. Yeah, okay. you feel those? Yeah. If you pinch them, you'll make your character look down. Pinch those strings, add some tension <gasps> to it. I see it. I yep, see it. I see it. There you go. And a lot of our talking is done with uh, head gestures and hand gestures that, that give the impression because small moving mouths that just doesn't carry on our stage. Got to. So, for example, if I'm going to talk, I, I'll probably just talk by punctuating with my head and, and my hands a little something like this. And you know what I can do at this point is I can, I agree. Oh, yes. I agree you with you. <laughs> there you go. Yes, I agree. Now, can you shake your head? No, no, no. I just don't agree. Pinch those shoulder strings and then rock the control bar. Shoulder you, strings? We didn't that, talk about shoulder that, that, strings. Those are the ones you're pinching with your fingers right there. And then rock? And now, that, that's a okay, no. Okay, this okay. is a no. There you go. She looks yeah, more yeah. confused. That's well, a, I, think for, right. I think I'm confused. I'm going to try to walk backwards again. <laughs> For All our right. purposes, you can hover her back to the starting point. We're going to hover give, back to the starting her a, point. Give her a little jaunty walk. Try this out right here. A jaunty here. walk? Yeah. You just are so good da, at da, that. Da, da, da. Try that out. Oh, that hurt jaunty. more than I want to say. There you go. Bounce along. Again, I look like Forrest Gump. Bounce along. All right. And we're going to let the professionals <laughs> take it from here, you guys. Okay, I'll tell you what. We are going to have a professional show from uh, you guys when you come back, and we have another character to introduce to our audience as well. Yes, we do. We have an ice skater. An ice skater. This is not to be missed. That was sad. Thank you, guys. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Miss Flora. You did my great. Apology. You did great. You did great. Well, that I need a little practice. That's okay. Maybe I'll get some when we take a break. You guys stick around. We'll be right back. Miss Flora.